In this final video, we'll be finding the equation of a perpendicular line. Okay? It's very similar to finding the equation of a parallel line with one very important change. Find the equation of a line passing through the given point and perpendicular to the line represented by the given equation. Write your answer in slope intercept form. Okay, just like the last time, the only thing I need from here is the slope. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and change this to slope intercept form so I can find the slope. Here's where the change comes in. The slope of this line is negative 5 6. Okay? But I'm not going to use that slope because I want the slope of the line that is perpendicular. So, I need to take this slope and find the negative reciprocal. Okay? So the slope I'm going to use, I'm going to flip it over to 6 over 5 and I'm going to change the sign so it becomes goes from negative to positive and goes from 5 over 6 to 6 over 5. So this is the slope that I'm going to use because I want the slope that's perpendicular to that line. So now I have my slope. So now I need to do the same thing I did, right? Use my slope, plug in the point. So y equals mx plus b. This just cancels to 0, and I get negative 2 equals b. So I get y equals 6 fifths x minus 2. Okay, and notice... This is perpendicular to that line, right? It has a slope that's opposite reciprocal. And if I plug in this point, it'll work, right? This is 6 fifths times 0 is 0, minus 2 is negative 2. Okay, so it's perpendicular to that line, and it goes through this point. Let's try this one. Okay, the slope right here is negative 1. So I need the opposite or negative reciprocal. Okay, so this is negative 1 over 1 when I flip it. It doesn't, it doesn't make a difference. The reciprocal of 1 is 1. Okay, but I do need to change the sign, so my new slope is positive 1. Okay, that is my slope, positive 1. So now, let's use my y plus mx plus b to find my y-intercept. So I'm going to plug in y equals mx plus b. 1 times 5 is just 5. I get negative 4 equals b. So my line is y equals 1x, just x, plus b. Okay, notice this is <coughs> perpendicular, right? This has a slope of negative 1, this has a slope of positive 1. Those are opposite reciprocals. And it goes through this point, right? So <coughs> if I plug in 5 here, 5 minus 4 is 1. Okay, and that's my answer.